That's right, it is time for Lego Minifigures. Curiously, a series I've not actually done on this channel, despite the fact I've been collecting since like series 8 or something, and now they're up to series 18. So I thought, because it's kind of a special thing, uh, as the packaging says here, it is in celebration of 40 years of Lego minifigures, I guess, because Lego's been around a lot longer than 40 years. But regardless, I thought, hey, why not buy a few packs of these and open them up on camera uh, because I'm trying to make more content for the channel really um, quite like doing videos anyway that doesn't matter let's jump into it so as you can see here there's a collection of quite a few of them these are some of them there's like two people dressed as Lego bricks and a bunch of other people but we'll look at those in a second so I'm just gonna go ahead and open them up and stuff and we'll see what we get I'm kind of hoping for the guy in the brick costume and the lady in the brick costume but you know what much like the rest of these series sometimes i end up actually loving the minifigures i least expected to like so let's take a look we have a elephant ballerina woman brick man and brick woman uh, a clown which Okay, you know, not really sold on. Rocket Man, definitely up for getting that one. Uh, we have Cactus Lady. Um, we have a man and a cake. Uh, Sp Spider Ninja Man. Spider Man, I guess. Ha <laughs> ha, get it? Police Officer. Uh, Dragon. A girl at a theme park. Uh, oh, well, I guess just a girl at a party or something. Party girl. Uh, which makes sense because there is an anniversary. We have Catwoman. We have R race, race Car Man, Woman in a Flower Pot. Cowboy Man. Uh, we have Boy, uh, the Birthday Boy, I guess. And we have a Unicorn Knight. I've got to admit, um, out of all of the series that have been for the last uh, couple, this is definitely the weirdest one, but... And that's kind of why I wanted to get it. Um, and on the back, it just shows you a few of the specialist things, how to put them together. But we can work that out together. Um, what even is... That is an interesting looking thing for the clown. What? Okay. Okay, right. Time to delve into the first pack, which... Ooh! Oh, okay. They're orange bases. They're usually black, actually. I'm going to move these out of the way. Uh, and let's see, I think I've got the flower pot lady because it's got a flower pot here. Uh, right, I'm going to pull everything out and kind of assemble her, I guess. Before I put it in the plant pot, I thought I'd show off actually the. Uh, it's quite a clever little minifigure design. She's got two faces, um, but yeah, she's got the little plant thing. So uh, chuck on her helmet or her hat or, you know, whatever. Um, and I guess I don't. Oh, oh, okay. I think that's meant to go under her legs. Right, I'll be right back. All right, so I'm back with the Demogorgon from uh, Stranger Things Series 2. Looking pretty uh, pretty pleasant here. I do like the fact that her feet can still move a little bit in the, um, in the flower pot. It's a bit rattly, as in, like, it doesn't actually stick too hard, but... Uh, you know, put her on the base there, and that's a that's a, that's a pretty good minifigure. That's um, that's definitely one of the ones, as I mentioned earlier, of the kind of ones I wasn't fussed on, but once I actually you know put them together and had a look, really uh, grew on me. So let's bust into pack two. Okay, there we are. Sorry, that took me a second there. Uh, let's get the pamphlet out again. Um, right, who who are we going to guess it's going to be this time? I would rather like a Brickman or Woman. Spider-Man would actually be pretty cool. Or Cactus. Uh, definitely, or maybe race car person. Catwoman, I guess. Um, yeah, well, let's just go ahead and see. It's open now, anyway. So, uh, grab the base first, which doesn't seem to... Aha! It's there. Okay, so they're all orange. That's uh, good to know. It looks like we have a cowboy person. Oh, oh, it's the guy with the horse attached to his crotch. Um, which, you know, I'm, I, I'm not judging. I'll, um, I'll go ahead and put him together and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back with the uh, cowboy dude. I've got to say that this minifigure is actually quite cleverly made. So the uh, 
tail hooks on to like his uh, leg piece there and then the top hooks over his um, his head so it kind of stays level and stuff without it being a gigantic rubber piece also both pieces are made of rubber which is interesting um, I've done that a few times in the previous sets but I don't know rubber just doesn't quite feel right on Lego minifigs but regardless he is a pretty cool looking minifig and uh, much like Flower Pot Woman is just the right level of weird that it makes the minifigures worth it because there's been quite a few um, series in the past where you'll get like cheerleader man or man in American football you know outfit which is interesting but equally kind of does feel like something you just get in a regular big Lego set or something anyway let's jump ahead now these last two are actually quite bulky so I'm hoping at least one of them is the brick people uh, the the brick man or woman so I'm just gonna grab the tile put that there and we have oh okay it's a uh, elephant person I shall go ahead and build them and I'll be right back okay I'm back with the uh, elephant woman she does have two um, faces actually so there's the screaming one which is completely out of focus and there is just the smoking one but I chose the screaming one as you will see in a second uh, this minifigure also comes with an adorable little mouse uh, which is actually super adorable like those eyes are almost anime level of are the eyes slightly off actually they're, they're not quite level but whatever it's got a nice uh, tail and this isn't rubber actually this is actual plastic um, and as you've noticed I've actually zoomed in a little bit because well these minifigures are surprisingly small uh, so I will zoom out for a second because we have the final pack will this be one of the brick people I prefer the guy because I prefer blue over red wait oh okay it's the girl that's blue okay I prefer the girl because I prefer blue over red but I'm not arguing either way let's pull this out let's pull the stand out let's move these things aside and our final one oh yes is cactus woman right I'm gonna go and build and I'll be right back actually never mind the whole I'll go build her thing I'll build her right now because she comes in four pieces there's the leg piece the charming torso piece which uh, as you can see here does not particularly have flexible arms or anything then you have the head of a woman who has been talked into wearing a cactus outfit uh, but is not too sure about it does she have reversible yes she does let's keep it with that though because she doesn't look too too sure about all this and then let's add the final touches now that that is hands down one of my favorite minifigures admittedly she's breaking the mold a little bit because the arms aren't movable and well apart from her legs and technically her head if you pull this off um you know she's definitely the more static or whatever but man i'm actually genuinely happy to um have got that one because it reminds me a bit of a cactuar from uh, final fantasy anyway i'm gonna go line them up in a pleasing display manner and then i'll discuss them at the end okay so i'm back i've lined them up uh so i've kind of arranged them from left to right uh you know the elephant one was very cool the cowboy person uh, I like it you know very clever design admittedly I'm not I don't know cowboys are cool and stuff I guess but it's kind of the level of silly where it'd be like ah isn't this a silly minifigure rather than ah oh, cool a cowboy uh, then we've got plant woman who I very much appreciate and another plant woman actually but this time she is a cactus so yeah overall um that about wraps up the video. I just thought I'd take a look at these minifigures. I uh, might do some more in the future. Who knows? I may actually buy a few more packs of these because uh, there are some still interesting ones. I'd maybe like to get like Spider-Man and Brick People. Those are, you know, those are three things I'd quite like to get. So, uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. And I will see you guys next video. Goodbye.